All right, I wanna show you how the CW filter works. This is the filter out, and I flow the switch, the filter's up, in. You hear the other CW signal in there? He's gone, right? You hear the other signals in there now? Watch. Watch. They're gone, right? They're gone, see? See how useful that is? Show you how I did it. Well, I didn't really do it, but it's the Hypermite, an active CW filter, completely outboard to the Ubit X. The audio line comes from the Ubit X, goes to the input here, filters it down to about, oh, about two or 300 hertz wide, and then the output goes to the speaker. So it's completely outboard. There's no need to mess around with modifying the CW filter or changing the BFO frequency or anything like that. Works really well. Very pleased with it. And it gives me the kind of selectivity that I got kind of used to when I was using my Drake 2B. Get the other CW signals in there now. And when you tune across, you can see how many, how long it, how wide it is with without the filter in. You hear the CW signal? But watch when I put the filter in. Here are all the signals in there, watch. Watch this. Pandemonium, right? You hear him? Without the filter, a lot of other signals in there. Without the filter, you got a lot of signals in there. Kind of hard to hear that guy. There you go. Four States QRP, the Hypermite, strongly recommended.